Hey guys, welcome to Me Paintings. I'm Veronica and today's video will be very special because I want to show you how to create amazing piece of art using very cheap supplies. And the reason why I'm doing it is because I've got lots of friends and followers who always say oh, I would love to start with acrylic pouring but you need all these expensive materials and supplies and I can't start, I can't really afford that expensive material. Well, today I want to show you how to create this beautiful acrylic pour using only cheap supplies. So we can start. I want to show you what I do. It's also for those who love acrylic pouring but who don't want to waste expensive material and who would like to experiment more like me. So when I experiment, I, I'm not using the expensive pouring mediums and expensive acrylic colors. I just use what I can buy for cheap, cheap price but it works very well. So firstly, you will need your canvas and I'm using this one, which cost me one euro. I bought this one in Mabelix and it's actually quite a good quality canvas. I regret I didn't buy more. I, I think I will go buy more. And yeah, you just need to look for sales and special offers in shops like Mabelix or Lidl or Kik or something like that, a dollar shop or pound shop. I don't know whatever you have got in your country you can find very good prices there so just have it in mind and every time you see some cheap canvas buy it for your experiments it's not expensive one euro and that's all you need or you can also find like some stuff for free like big stones on the beach uh, and paint on them yeah that's for free so that's another option but uh, there will be another video so I've got my canvas and now I need my colors. I bought these kind of colors. You need quite a lot of acryl colors, so I recommend buying uh, like at least 75 milliliters if you want to do bigger canvas. And this one was one euro as well. I bought this one in Kik. I don't know if you have got this shop in your country, but I'm sure you can buy loads of like cheap acryl colors which you can have for your experiments this one is purple and I also will be using red and yellow yeah they've got loads of different colors and white then you will need your pouring medium and for that I found this PVA glue in art shop which was like six euros but I'll it's one liter and I'll be using like 100 milliliters of it, so that means like 60 pence. So there's already like four, five euros for that. Uh, and I mix my pouring medium from this PVA glue and I use 60% of this glue and 40% of water. I mix it well together and then I mix half part of that pouring medium and half part of acrylic colors. That's my formula, which I use and which works quite well. And then you think, oh, I will need some silicone oil. Well, for that, I'm using a very simple to uh, washing up liquid. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm using and it should create a lovely cells. So I just put like two drops of washing up liquid and mix it with water. And I will be putting a little bit of it in each color, like, like maybe two, three drops, like that. Oops, it was a little bit more than it should be, but it's okay. So you just stir it with your colors, like that. And you think, oh yeah, I will also need these plastic cups and these kind of um, sticks. Uh, so it's another expense. Uh, well, what I'm using is I recycle your... Oops! Oh no! Sorry, so I just 
put my washing up liquid on my canvas so silly me never mind i wanted to show you this cup and yeah, my kids eat these yogurt yogurt so i use them for as, as cups and that's for free and i also use these sticks uh, which are from ice creams so you can use them for stirring your colors and it's for free so that's no expenses for that and for my pouring medium I usually use these types of bottles this is from some chili sauce and it's quite good because you can squeeze it in your colors and it works perfectly and it's also free so you can just recycle things which you already have at home you just need to think about it and don't check them away and keep them for like for next time that's what I love about this because you can experiment as much as you want and you just need like five dollars five to ten dollars or euros so you can start don't hesitate to start with acrylic pouring you don't need this expensive material i mean if you start selling your art you start using the more expensive material material because it it works better than the cheap material but you can start with this one and create something amazing so let's start so i've got this cup which is from some kind of party i just took it and now i can reuse it let's start pouring my white firstly white will be my base then purple and red again my white now yellow and red I'm a little bit clumsy but sometimes from my clumsiness there's an amazing result white then I will put this lovely purple in here uh, let's put my yellow Now all of it. I'm gonna put all of my yellow in this cup. White again. And red. and white let's put this cup away I'm also gonna put some white on my edges because it will help my colors to flow around edges don't waste any colors let's put it all here and now 
we can start making this just flip it like that and you can start moving your cup slowly around your canvas like that and look at that it's already creating some amazing cells I don't want to waste any of this let's put it all here and now you would think oh I need my heat gun or torch to create cells but you actually don't need it if you have got the right mixture of pouring medium and your uh, washing up liquid you you will get cells or what I do I always bang with my canvas like this and it helps my see it helps my cells to pop and oh look you will get some cells even though you don't have your your heat gun or torch look at that Ooh. Now slowly move it to the edges and you can help to spread your colors with your hands. Go back so you get the nice cells. Look at these. Try to be quite slow because um, if you'll be too quick you will lose your nice cells last corner here we come I don't want to lose these yellow yellow cells. I like them, so I'm going to try to move this to the edge and then I'm going to go back and they will stretch. And create something amazing. Look at that! Look how amazing this looks with using only very cheap supplies. So don't be afraid to experiment. If you are thinking about acrylic pouring, you can start with cheap supplies. You can create amazing piece of art using only things which you find in sale and I promise you will definitely enjoy it because, because this is so satisfying. I love this technique. 
because it gives you such a freedom and it guides you where to unexpected areas well that's my very cheap acrylic pour but I'm very happy with the result still some cells growing in here if you leave it your cells will grow if I blow it with my mouth it might create even more cells Well, I hope you enjoyed my <laughs> my tutorial. Thank you very much for watching. If you liked my video, please give it a thumbs up. Or if you are new to my channel, please subscribe or watch my other videos where you can find other useful tips for acrylic pouring. Thank you very much for watching and see you soon. Bye.